and then I'm asking from the, all that nutrients to come in and kind of by asking and by being grateful, I open up more to those nutrients, you know? And this is, this is, this is something that, you know, is not, I guess, linked to any, um, um, any form of official uh, way of presenting nutrition and how you should eat and how you should drink. It's, 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 uh, it's the connection that you're talking about, the inner connection and really being present and being conscious of the moment and being conscious of the fact that you're drinking water. And I've, you know, I've, I've, I've seen people and I, I know some people that through that um, energetical transformation, through the power of prayer, through the power of, of gratitude, they managed to turn the most toxic food or maybe most polluted water into the most healing water because water reacts. And, and uh, you know, water is alive. scientists have proven that, that obviously in the, in the experiment, that molecules of the water react to our emotions, to what is being said. So, so I, I truly believe that, that we should continuously, every single day, remind ourselves when we sit, that we sit without, without cameras, without phones, and without watching things and stuff, or, or even worse, uh, to, uh, having a, uh, um, you know, a nervous discussions and, and, and conflictual discussions on the table with your, con conf uh, with your close ones uh, uh, during your meal. Uh, and, and, oh. I remember, and I remember my, my grandfather uh, who passed away eight years ago, and I was very, very close to him. He was, um, he was always very quiet when he was eating. And I could never understand because like, you know, when I was a kid, you know,